Flown to friends. It was a good time. Yeah, so Bastadio is a company that does um, uh, uh, visual programming. Right? Yeah. And, yeah. and you've actually Ooh. created uh, a visual of the data around yeah. the Strata conference, right? So you've taken the tweet stream. And so first of all, tell us a little bit about Bastadio and, and in your own words. And then okay. We'll, we got a little demo so that uh, we're going to run. Okay, the, right. So uh, in Bastadio, I've been working s during the last five years. Uh, we are almost the only company in Spain which is uh, working with data visualization, with information visualization. And uh, we'll, uh, we are actually involved, we are a very small company, we are about 11 people working. And uh, during the last year, we have been joining our, uh, all the efforts from the company to develop uh, what we call a visual programming language, which is called Impure, which is available at impure.com. It's a web-based web application. Impure. impure. Yeah, impure. Impure. Com. I am P and you guys were at the science yeah. fair last night. Uh, the yeah, we were yesterday at the science fair. Yeah, yeah. By the way, it was a really great event. It was what time did that end? At that point, I, yeah, I went till eleven. Till yeah, till nine thirty. Still going 10? actually. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> almost. Yeah, almost. <laughs> There's yeah. stuff on a lot of content here. This people was pretty excited with it, and that we were really happy to be able to show our work here in the states. And uh, it's the very first time we have been here showing. Well, actually, we went to the uh, Bizweek uh, conference. Uh, it was last November also to show the tool. And the idea is that Impure is a visual programming language. So, um, I M P U R E dot com right, right, is how right, you, you get that. Right, okay. Here it is. Yeah. Here's the demo. Right. All right so, we're, st we're starting so to yeah, we, demo. We, yeah, we're seeing a teaser video, uh, which is in, in YouTube. So, we can see that. The idea of Impure is that there uh, we have developed a bunch of different modules, and these modules uh, are divided in different families, such as data structures and uh, visualizers and so on. So uh, we used to say that non-programmers can be able to use these modules and drag them into an infinite canvas to create new uh, data flows. So Impure is not just for creating visualizations. We believe that it is a tool to create a whole information flow, a whole data flow. So anybody can uh, grab data from an API, such as Flickr, such as Delicious, and so on, or just uh, load data from a CSV file that can be uploaded to any server or whatever. And, uh, use uh, different modules to process this data and to manipulate it and uh, also have the ability to use some visualizer modules that are that have been designed to allow the interaction with the data and that's what we were seeing in in that video and so you're interacting visually which is completely changes the programming experience Ex right? Just yeah that's some of the what are you guys doing for the back end are you using um like a hadoop hbase using any kind of no actually theory? actually we, we're just using uh the whole software has been developed in action script 3 and uh, that's the, the client, the, the interface, while we have uh, some modules that interact with uh, our servers that do stuff with some other APIs and uh, do some clustering things and so on. So you, you wrote your own environment exactly. to handle the data. That's, yeah, that's, that's the idea. Because of the interface with the visual side? Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, that's the idea. So, uh, I don't know if we're seeing... Are we the running demo? the demo? Yeah. It's actually live. Okay. Okay, so we're. Okay, so uh, I think that Santiago is building here. So he's uh, a little ahead of us, right? There's a little, little slight delay. Okay, so here, no, here, let me just give the play-by-play -play here. So we have Santiago, is it? He's actually yeah. on on the producer desk doing this live. So what you're seeing on the screen here is actually a live representation of the visual software. Yeah. So what he's doing, he's actually he has just generated uh, a circle, what we call a circle tag cloud of uh, data from Twitter. And that's uh, real, uh, real life data. He's just uh, pulling data from from the Twitter API, and uh, as we can see, there's different modules in this visualization, in this uh, workflow. So there are some uh, the API of Twitter. There's also some modules that um, just extract data from the tables that these modules grab. And uh, w one of the main ideas of Impure, I think, is pretty important, is that visualization in Impure is not the the end of the analysis. So usually in, uh, in our world today, people process data and end up generating visualizations to explore them, to understand the data, and also to ge they generate some other images, some other visualizations to communicate this data. In Impure, the idea is to, uh, you are able to create uh, data loops. So uh, visualizations are not just the end part of the analysis, but they can be part of the whole information flow. So um, 
you can use the visualizations to select data that you are interested in and then um, use this data to uh, uh, and send it to another API or to another visualization to continue uh, analyzing it. Okay, so you said you, you guys are- so He's so clicking the, around, okay, there so it is. See an example, so, so you're 11 people, when did you guys start? Well, we started working with Impure about a year ago, something like that. Okay. Yep. And so now you're you're about to do, have you gone commercial with it? Or well, you, not yet. Uh, we are actually uh, we have an alpha version. So he's doing something right now. What is this? Yeah, this, this is visualization is this pretty interesting. Yeah, uh, this visualization uh, is showing the text. Use it in delicious regarding three different uh, websites that I can see right here. But we can see different tags and uh, how are they related to these uh, different websites. So it's a, a way to explore the universe within the issues regarding three different websites. So, uh, so yeah. it, what's the user experience like? I, uh, uh, tell me w what I would do. I want to sit down. I want to do something. What is that something? Okay, and I what do I have to do to interact okay. with this? System? Okay, that's interesting. I think that Impure can be used for technical people. They should be the ones who can generate these uh, workspaces, these uh, data workflows. And uh, also, Impure allows to just hide the kind of kind of, of the backbones of the of the workspace. So only the visualizations and some controllers that help on interacting with this visualization might be visible. So um, these uh, workspaces can be shared with other people. So, uh, for instance, analysts who they don't have to know how to use Impure by itself. They will just they get, get a pro they get a product. Exactly, a like, product. Like, like what we're seeing here. Here we're just seeing some visualization, nothing else. And there's a, a set of uh, modules behind these visualizations that uh, are actually uh, the ones that generate these visualizations. And that's the idea. So we have the idea that you can generate the workspace, you can be the producer of this workspace, or you can be the consumer of this workspace. And in Impure you can you can publish your workspace and uh, how are you how are you question how are you getting the data i mean so you subscribing to the fire hose you're getting services are you hitting apis up well yeah we, we're actually I mean, twitter's got a rate limit i mean you got to get yeah you get actually, the yeah well, well first of all it's very important to stress out that uh, i'm using an alpha stage and uh, we're, we're working very hard with it and uh, actually we have developed our own Twitter API, so we have some uh, ground jobs, some bots that are constantly grabbing data from Twitter and storing it in our servers. So we are actually taking advantage from public APIs and uh, like So you gotta get one. you gotta work around the rate limit yeah, right now. Yeah, exactly. yeah. Got it. Okay. Yeah, and there's other RSS data out there too, yeah, right? Yeah. Blogs and Twitter. Yeah. How about Facebook? Is there well, any Facebook? Because Facebook's got a weird data environment because it's kind of yeah, crazy. Yeah, we are not actually working with Facebook. Actually, what you can do, there, there are a couple of services that, that you can install in your Facebook account and you can download the, uh, your network. So this 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 can be done and uh, you can get your network with a GDF file. So you can load this GDF file within Impure and uh, use Impure to, to visualize it. Okay, so what's next for the company? What's your plans? Uh, you know, well, as we as, as Strata kind of comes to an end, yeah. you know, you got to kind of go to the next level of funding. You, yeah, you know, but, what, but are you what, what, what we were seeing right now is what we call the, the, the flow visualization of the different uh, words Whoa. using the tweets regarding Stratacom. So we can see how I think that this uh, dark uh, line ar around there is the, the data tag. So uh, about the company, we are actually just focused on yeah, leave the demo up. Keep the demo going so we can look at the demo. Okay, cool. So um, we are actually working to launch a beta version of Impure, which is going to be available hopefully uh, next summer. And uh, our plans are to continue working with Impure. We have to grab some uh, use case to show uh, we want this tool not just to be beautiful and uh, appealing. We want this yep. tool to be useful. We want people solving their problems, the problems of their company with with impure yeah. and to do so is uh, we're actually working with pretty big companies in spain that they are uh giving us the data and uh, we're yeah, yeah. developing workspaces for them so mm -hmm. so we're, we're obviously broadcasting we have this on demand and in front of a lot of people what do you want to share with them about what your goals are and what you'd like people to know about uh, okay impure and your company okay i think that Regarding Impure, I think that uh, it might be a, a, a really good tool for for those professionals that they already know how to program visualization. I think that it can be a very good 
tool for make for sketching. So for trying out your data, for trying uh, your things, because in Impure you can mix different visualizations, you can overlay one on top of the other. So you can create pretty crazy visualization with Impure. So I think that for these kind of professionals, they can use Impure in that sense. And regarding those people that are not programmers, for those analysts that they need to uh, get insight from their data, I think that Impure can help them quite a lot because it is it is much more easier than, than starting uh, learning how to program action script or any other language. So we're here at uh, at Strata Live with Victor Pasqual of uh, Be Bestialio, yeah, right. Barcelona based <laughs> Bestialio, yeah. young company, in very States, interesting, changing in the way Silicon in which you Valley interact on the road show. Data. Yeah, yeah so Victor, th I mean, thank you very much for coming on and sharing thank with us. Thank you very the, much for inviting me. Hey, like the, the Cube is global. We do not discriminate against knowledge, and thank you for coming on from Spain. Okay. Uh, great stuff. Uh, we're Global Knowledge Hub here at the Cube. Thanks so much, Victor, Thank you very much. for coming and on the Cube. Get your account at Impu.com yeah. and let us know. Let us get us an account at okay. siliconangle.com and Impu.org. All right, thank you. Thanks so much. Okay, All so. Right. Yeah, right. We got yeah, Drew, Drew applause. Yeah. We love it. That guy's he's fantastic. Uh -huh. we got